Hey guys, how's it going? The Great Unboxer here and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing for you guys of the brand new MacBook Pro. Now this is the 13 inch model with the Retina display and I did pick this up with my student discount which gave me $200 off the computer plus I did also get a $100 gift card for to use with either the App Store or the iTunes Store which is pretty fantastic if you ask me. But anyway, without further ado, here is the MacBook Pro itself and taking a look around the box on the front here, we do have a closed image of the MacBook Pro. On the bottom, we do have MacBook Pro on the side. We have Apple logo and it's pretty much the same around the box. Nothing much to say here, but I do actually prefer the older box, which had the handle and stuff like that. Because I don't know, I just feel like that was a better design of a box but also here is a look at my specifications of my computer if you want to have a look please pause the video right now if not here we go we're breaking off the seal and all that good stuff as you can see i just love taking plastic off new products i just i don't know i just love that feeling do you guys have that same feeling or is it just me it probably is just me but ah oh, i don't know what it is it's just fantastic like when you take off the plastic of a new product, especially, especially if it's an expensive product. I mean, come on. <laughs> but anyway, lifting off the top part of the box, we see the computer there just in just... Oh, I can't even explain how awesome it looks right now. It's just so thin and shiny and new and just awesome. And the screen, the screen, oh my goodness, the screen is fantastic. I uh, just got to can't even so I'm just gonna put this to the side for a second and take a look at inside the box here is your charger for the computer they did change the the cable as you can see here it's slightly it's kind of fatter in a way yet thinner I don't know I prefer the older charger if you ask me but I don't know I don't really know why they changed the design of the charger but anyway there is the extension cable for the charger and just trying to put that back into the box moving on we do also have this black booklet thingy i don't know what you call this but inside you got some awesome stuff and on the front here it says designed by apple in california as per usual opening it we are greeted with hello and basically that's just a quick start guide you also get some other stuff which I'll show you in a second but here is the quick start guide and it just basically tells you how to start your computer and get it going stuff like that but yeah I mean it's good that they include a quick start guide and not like a full-on manual like they did for the older computer moving on we do have the important product information guide which I never read and I don't know what they actually are talking about in there but Apple includes this with all their products next we also do have the Apple stickers which everyone loves and here is the cleaning cloth that I personally love I just love Apple's cleaning cloth like they should give us two cleaning cloths instead of one anyway here is the MacBook Pro itself in its loveliness and it's just oh it's so thin what even it's like my computer just took a diet man but peeling off the plastic and just, oh, brand new computer, man. Awesome, awesome stuff. Taking off the plastic here and having a look around the computer. As you can see, it pretty much looks the same as all the other MacBook Pros. But on the side here, we do have the MagSafe power adapter thing where you charge your computer. Got two Thunderbolt ports, a USB port and audio jack and two built-in microphones. On the other side, we do have another USB port, HDMI cable, and the HDMI port and the SD card slot. Opening the computer, as you can see here, it looks pretty much the same as the other MacBook Pro, except that for the fact that it doesn't have the MacBook Pro logo on the screen anymore. And here is my very lame attempt in doing some sort of a fancy thing for the keyboard, but it obviously failed. So that is all from me guys. I want to thank you guys for watching. Please do subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!